All right. Uh, let's get started. Uh, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy, the man, the myth, the legend, Zombo, coming at you live. I'm gonna be playing some Forza Motorsport 7 tonight, and uh, yeah, we're gonna have a good time. Uh, hopefully, there's not too much rage in this session. I get uh, really competitive when it comes to. Well, pretty much any type of competitive game, even when it comes down to racing mode. Okay. Make sure uh, the stream was working fine. And, uh, it is. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah, everything seems to be fine. Let's get to it. Now, um, pretty much in my last session, I was able to win the Seeker Championship, and there's my, uh, my trophy, trophy right there. Um, and we could go on to the next one, and as much as I would like that, I want to finish the other... Um, the other challenges uh, all these so I think, uh, I think we'll just do that is this one the seeker open in open racing you could choose any car you want and go up against other drivers who'll be using cars from the same division it makes for high tension and ferocious racing and not a bad way to spend an afternoon I was gonna say okay so Okay, um... Got this baby for a reason and I want to race it. Yeah, I'm gonna, uh, I really want to race with my, uh... Rain clouds rolling in. Get ready for a wet track. My Nissan GTR Black Edition, Forza Edition. Well, let me finish off this tea. So, um. So, to anybody who doesn't know, uh, Forza Edition cars. Uh, you can tell that they're Forza Edition because they'll have like a certain, like a, uh, kind of like a, like a passive ability on them. Um, uh, in Horizon, that's when they mostly had Forza Edition cars. In uh, Forza Horizon, um, I should say three for the latest one. Uh, you know, your cars would either give you extra credits, extra XP. Um, uh, some cars can drift better, some cars, like, you know, they're, it, it was just something special about them that, that would essentially help you out. Um, yeah, and, and also if you don't, if you can't tell uh, from some of the cars, the Forza Edition cars have the Forza uh, logo, or the, the name Forza on the tires, that, that kind of helps out. I kind of want to save this, to be honest, maybe for like the higher races, probably save it for that, let's just start. Dirty, then I have to play dirty. 
in that turn, but we were covered. Everyone else had to do the turn anyway, so. Not like we were screwed, they were slowing down too. We we're just going a little bit faster than they were. No fucking joke too, this thing, this thing is faster than a Ferrari. This thing will beat a Ferrari. It's probably one of the best things like Nissan has ever created. This thing is an absolute beast. Again, GTR. This one and, uh, and the Nismo, which are pretty much like it's the same. Like a, a Nismo GTR, slight difference uh, between the two cars, but they're almost the same. But it, just a regular Nissan GTR is always the best option. The Nismo is like the second close. For the uh, the Nismo, they mostly use it in the professional races. Like for all the professional race car drivers, like that are representing Nissan or that choose to like drive a Nissan, they always drive a Nismo. best choice, but it's almost the same. Almost. Is that the GTR and like a Nismo or like a GTR and Nismo just have like, like small differences, but they have different qualities that make both of them like pretty good. So each is their own, but I, I prefer the normal Nissan GTR. Oh shit! Oh, I got, okay, I wanted to show off the front and I got, I got careless. Ooh, oh, it's too fucking close. This baby is just keeping me in the front, which I like. Yeah, like I, I know this one's, this, in case uh, you guys don't know, this one is the, uh, on GTR Black Edition, it's an edition, but I didn't want to keep it black. So it is the Black Edition. I didn't want to keep it black. I wanted to, to make it look nice. And I didn't beat anybody who has this fucking car. Like, you are the luckiest person. Representing, uh, <laughs> uh, I am repping the uh, the Persona 5 uh, uh, look to it. I, I like uh, like that design that somebody made, um, which they did a really good job. I really do like it. it looks fucking great on this car. Yeah, it's just awesome. Really, we don't have to do much for the Secret Championship now that we've uh, won it. I'm, trying to, I'm a completionist, and I like to uh, uh, pretty much complete, you know, um, complete whatever's like in front of me. Ah, oh, damn it! I forgot to show one one more thing. Um, well, I could get a car. Oh fuck no, nah. The WRX, nah. I'm gonna pass on that. Ooh, now that Jaguar. Hmm. Now that's something I would like to add to my collection. That WRX, nah. No, thank you. That fuckboy car, nah. No, thank you. I could do without it. I could do without it. All right. Oh, but um, uh, yeah. I don't think I, I showed it. But this baby um, gives me about 10,000 credits, and that's if I race it specifically in a um, uh, specific place. So let me, okay, so right here, um, 12 Nissan GTR Black Edition, Forza Edition. So many editions for this beautiful car. Um, so here you go. Uh, oh, it's a 50% uh, 
uh, credit boost, I think just for, just for playing, uh, or just for driving this car around, plus you get an extra 10,000 credits if you race it at, uh, Suzuka, so, there you go. Circuit of the Americas. Oh yeah. Look at this baby from the back, man. From all sides. She is absolutely beautiful. Ugh. This is one of my dream cars. I I'd rather have this thing over like a Ferrari any day. This is fine. Why spend like 